Now, weeks after CNN News 18 highlighted the threat of illegal influx in Jharkhand Santal tribe region, the governor in the state has now highlighted the issue and told the police and the government to act upon the threat. So this is a CNN News 18 impact after we highlighted on what has been the illegal immigration into the uh, Jharkhand area, especially the Santal tribal region. Now the governor has in fact taken action and it has not just directed the police but also the government in the state to act upon, act upon the intel. Yes, uh, this has been brought to by to me by various uh, associations and various political parties also. That is very dangerous because the infiltration of foreigners will change the entire lifestyle of the tribal people. Especially they are coming and marrying the tribal woman is an alarming. We have to be very cautious about that. That, uh, that I have taken it up with the CM as well as the Chief Secretary also. The tribal's tradition should not be changed. The demography of the uh, jargon also should not get changed by the foreigners' infiltration. That we should be very careful about it. Let me bring in my colleague Saurav who is joining us live on the broadcast. Saurav, it was your report that we presented on CNN News 18 and now the impact of the report has reached the Raj Bhavan. The governor has responded and asked the police and the government in Jharkhand to act upon what has been gathered through this intel. What are we learning through the administration? Are they responding to the governor's statement now? See, Griha, uh, you know, after uh, spending over a week in uh, Jharkhand, Santhal, Pargana and covering over 2,000 kilometers, we came to the con conclusion that uh, actually the demography of uh, certain districts of Santhal, Pargana such as uh, Pakur, uh, so, uh, uh, Sahib Ganj, Pakur, Goda, Devghar, mm. these areas, the demography was indeed changing. And if you go through the official census report, uh, according to the last census report, of 42% uh, uh, of Muslim population rose in particularly Pakur and 37% Muslim population, uh, you know, uh, increased in Sahib Ganj districts uh, alone. So uh, imagine uh, the last census was done 11 years back and uh, when the new census will come, it will give a shocking figure. Mm. Uh, also, uh, we, we reported how uh, the demography was changing as well as uh, there were several constructions of mosques and madrasas were taking place. Uh, we, sh uh, we showed our viewers how uh, mm. within a range of 200 meters there were more than five uh, uh, madrasas that were in the process of uh, making and also there were cases where encroachment was taking place uh, on government land as well as on tribal lands. Uh, several such institutions were being made. We showed the visuals of how uh, the madrasa on forest lands were uh, were uh, in, uh, under construction so uh, uh, we came uh, to the conclusion we put our report in front of the government as well as in front of our viewers and uh, uh, certain uh, uh, politicians uh, such as Raghuvar Das uh, uh, you know uh, and other uh, BJP MPs also took cognizance of the report they had uh, submitted a report to the governor and now governor has uh, finally took a call uh, and the, he has asked for a report from the state government from as well as uh, from the uh, district police officers over there so it is yeah. to be seen what uh, reports are uh, are going to be submitted but as far as uh, this particular case is concerned there was there was a pil also filed mm. in the ranchi high court in which the state uh, was the partner uh, uh, the uh, the state had to submit a report uh, first uh, on the first hearing uh, on 19th of this month uh, the, the state reported that there was no uh, such type of uh, you know infiltration reported from anywhere but uh, the fact and figures shows that the population of a certain section of uh, society has yes. drastically changed in last 10 years yes. and 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 because uh, the constructions that are going on that has mm. not been reported and not been submitted to the Rachi High Court by the district administration although uh, we spoke to the superintendent of police Pakur he uh, never mm. denied that uh, the, the there was any possibility of infiltration there could okay. be a possibility of infiltration because it's a very porous border as well as absolutely uh, one 